up you guys after Jerry Axion today I'm going to be reacting to some more Marvel's Agents of Shield. This is season seven episode eleven. I don't know what the title is, uh, but it's kind of scary to think about because like this is episode eleven and then next week is gonna be the last two episodes. Ever. That's scary to think about. That's another TV show that I finished on the channel and that's it's very scary. Um, well, uh, as you can see, I dyed my hair pink, um, and it's faded a lot, um, you guys can let me know what you think, um, but yeah, hopefully we see Fitz this episode, because it's, it's getting to the end of the season, and there's been no Fitz, um, yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so, so far I don't find her compelling. Tell me all about her. Stay also, back. everyone told me that it's the, the John Garrett's, like, son. The actor. Please shoot him. James Jackson. They took Simmons. This is his name. Hey, where are we going? I think that's We're really cool. Going anywhere you are. The Zephyr's been hijacked. He did a really good here? job My imitating his father. Not what I thought she was looking at, but okay. Daisy, I can feel your guilt. This isn't your fault. I should have quaked that psychopath's bones part when I had the chance. 616. Yeah, but you were interrupted by me. You're clear, 616. Hey, of Cora. We can't tell her about Jiang Yin's death. She should know what her boyfriend did. Cora's not stable. Hearing that her mother died might set her off. If she's a bomb, then what's the plan if she explodes? Use that to me. I won't make the same mistake I made with Nathaniel. Oh, Daisy's on a mission! You must be Daisy. Yeah. Where did they take Simmons? Put her down, Agent Johnson. That's an order. I mean, you did the same thing, Max. I'm here to help. Why? I want to be an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. I don't understand her at all. 50,000 miles above Earth and rising, sir. Should be a killer view. I don't know this. Lay up this, sir. Trying to make it so no one has to call anyone sir ever again. Oh no, this is the wrong one. But I got one of these. Simple. And I also got this. It's level five. Just like Nakatomi Plaza. Alright, Deke. Time to save Simmons. Oh no. You got found immediately. When we confronted the older Gordon, Fitz designed a device to trap him in a room. Now, if we can find Fitz's specs on this hard mm. drive, we should be able to rig something up. Until then. Science, biatch! I'm your new babysitter. There's some strategy at play here because Sybil's been predicting our every move. It's too easy, I know. But now she's selling us the story of compliance. We may be Your better, compliance will be rewarded. But so is the enemy. I'm the perfect candidate. Why? The perfect instrument to save lives. What do you mean, instrument? Knowledge of history yet to be written. Lives have already been spared with it, my own. Agent Daniel Sousa, those two soldiers you just locked in a cell. Not all lives were saved. Some were taken. I'm sorry about your parents, but it's also the proof you needed. Proof? What? You must realize it by now. Proof that this is a new timeline. He gets it. That old one that you were fighting to preserve is long gone. It's a brand new day. Why not let S.H.I.E.L.D. make this universe the best it can be? And how do you plan on doing that? Killing. 30 names we can kill right now to save thousands of innocent lives. It sounds like Project Insight with a fancy new bow on it. Yeah. These are names you know. History knows committed unspeakable acts. do not even look really? alike. I don't like it. I thought I We're just... not morons, despite whatever Nathaniel has told you. I believe there's a chance we could work together. What makes you think that we would ever... You. I've always wanted a sibling. You believe in S.H.I.E.L.D.? There must be a reason. I think she should know about Jane. I thought I had a happy childhood. Didn't you? Every child loves her mother. Not every mother loves her back. I'm sorry you didn't get that. I'm sorry you threw it away. I just want to spend time together to talk. Sybil said, there is no future where Daisy Johnson lets her sister fight alone. 
She was right. Did you just give a case a good thing? I like to think about the first law of thermodynamics. There's no energy in the universe is created. The man is destroyed. Oh, man! As much as I would love to watch you leave Fitz catatonic, I need you to show me where he is now. That's all my eyes watering. What the fuck? You. Oh, man. Here. This is gonna get me. Together. We're professional and matter of fact and there's this chasm in the middle of the room of all these things of you are blocking me show me more i'm not doing anything maybe you're not equipped to... oh. hey who do you Tell think you are how mr emo backstreet boy looking dude i don't know john bring in the grandson Dick, he's here i'm trying to play hero mm. oh Nana, you David? What have they done to you? Oh, man. Hey, I was just coming to... That's different. You know, I learned a long time ago not to let somebody do something stupid on their own. Have you ever left your post before? Like, snuck off the base and, I don't know, played pool and got drunk. You think I'm the kind of person that would do that? Then this will be your first time. You coming? Sybil's whole plan is based on her projections. So the only way to... Get ahead is to act unpredictably. Two things against our nature, which for you is leaving my post. And you? Sybil dropped Cora in my lap because I knew I'd want to save her. Thing is, I already have a sister to save. Her name is Gemma Simmons. Ah, you called her that. Yes, getting out she's of the your atmosphere. sister. Yes, I like Almost. it. As long as you know what you're doing. You have flown this thing before, right? A time? Nah. It's your last chance to stay behind. It's so sweet. He's just following her everywhere. It's Look, you said sweet. You've zero times. I mean, everyone in Shields has flown a Quinjet. Literally everyone. Pick up his piece of cake. Yeah. How are you going to get the hangar doors open without director authorization? If we're gonna beat Sybil, we we have to be unpredictable. We can't. We can't play by her rules. And he agrees. How's this for unpredictable? Authorization granted. Now give me that seat before I change my mind. <laughs> I thought he would agree. Director of Shield gone rogue. Yeah, I've seen that happen before. <laughs> Leave him alone. Stop hurting D. He's got nothing. Stop it. <laughs> That was something. This one's got a mouse on him. Yeah. Physical pain won't break you. Congratulations. Oh. Now let's try the emotional. I'm so denial. proud of you. It's usually a little harder to tolerate. What if I crack her skull, put her in a coma, and then go fishing around in her brain? Stop! How is she blocking me from this? <sighs> Never mind. If you think that you can. No! That's for my old man. Is he okay? Find a way to get whatever that is out of her head. Is Dick okay? Guys, my stomach feels... <laughs> Thank you. I already know you. The cavalry. I saw how you handled that poor girl in Lorraine. She was out of control. She was. What you did was sickening. Fuck you! She was just a child. She would have done worse. Isn't that what your list is about? She had a power that she couldn't control. Yeah. That wasn't her fault. No, she she fed off something. Yeah. Do you? May did the right thing. Did you take pleasure in killing? Lee thought I was out of control. You were. Calm down. Show me that you can control your power. Or what? Huh? You'll strangle me? Cora. You want to see control? She took out the lighthouse's power with one punch. That's what Cora was here for. You killed my hunters. Prepare to meet the No, maybe sun. don't recite the messages out loud. I can read English. No, I it. really want them to be recited out loud. Can you read the rest of it? Uh, I think so. Enoch said that this will be the team's last mission together. Maybe it's time. What? How can you say that? That's it? Just talk to you later? That... Oh, look, we have these things called phones. Now, I know. I know you millennials like to use them just for taking pictures of yourselves, but in the 80s, we actually used them to talk to each other. 
I'm serious. We're, we're not just going to turn into the people who used to work together and, you know, used to be close a long time ago. That's kind of mm-hmm. sad because it's like them talking about the I, show. You guys are my family. I don't know who I am without you guys. No, Daisy. No, it's... You know exactly who you are with anyone. Why are you smiling? Because Yo-Yo owes me twenty dollars. <laughs> 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 